Yeah, man. Um, salute to everybody that be watching these. Um, yo, the wake up in this spot, man, is, is dope. Um, I'm about to head out to um, to go get something to eat, man. Wow, beautiful day. Pretty windy outside, yo. Man, nice view. Man, especially at night. But, um, got some things done on the laptop. Um, look at that. Yo, let me tell you. I was at the cigar lounge, right? Here's the crazy part about it. And next thing you ought to know where, I went to outside, so I left this same laptop um, when I was in Atlanta. I left this laptop there. Um, and I came back, had a brand new cord. All of a sudden, somebody's like literally switched cords with me. And now I got to carry this on the road, man. I don't know who did that, man. If I ever catch their butts. But um, nothing in the fridge. Nothing. See? Nothing's in the fridge. A bottle of water. And, and think about this. I'm overseas. Look at the name on it. Whoever got brought this from America. <laughs> they don't have great value overseas. So you know this, this spot is um, owned by American. But, um, yo, so, or uh, somebody that influences from America. But, so, this is the area I like sitting. Um, it's the area I like sitting. These lights, man, y'all gotta see this thing at night, you know. Man, I think I showed a little bit of it at night. But, uh, but yeah, so... Like don't work over there. It seems like it's really dark in this area. Yeah. It, over there, it's like it's really dark. It gets kind of dark over in that area. But um, the wind has been blowing like crazy here, man. So that window pane up there is broke. Look, so every time the wind blows, it, you see how it's clanking? And then when it's real like extreme gusts, man, that thing, it goes. In the, in the middle of the night, so you can't really see. I don't know why the wind is gusting like this. It must be a storm somewhere over the water. So somewhere in another part of the earth. But um, but yeah. So let's get ready to get out of here, man. Uh, I want to go get something to eat. I just did a couple live streams. So this is what I do every day. Chill, chill, chill to myself. Not doing much, man. Uh, so on, on my way to meet Dean, um, oh, I see him sitting right there on this corner. Yo, let me push this on my pocket. On my way to meet Dean, he's chilling with the older guy, so right there next to BB's on this corner. It is what it is, man. Yo, you gotta get out there and walk around. It took me about 30 minutes to get here, but I'm finally here. Yeah, so here on the beach, um, it's another part of the vlog. Here on the beach, um, Dean, he getting his massage. She does a real good massage. So if y'all live out here on the beach, y'all need to get one, yo. So we out here. We out here, just chilling. That's what you do in Brazil, you just chill. So nothing much, um, nothing much, but, uh, you see, I got my cigar. I'm telling Dean he needs to start smoking. Me and Dean got into a, a discussion uh, because Dean said once somebody say no, you should stop, which is true, which is true. I'm not going to take away from that. That's true from that. But uh, shout out to Dean for, uh, for chilling out with me today. Um, man, I'm telling you, Itagwai was mad. She heated. She's sending me all type of crazy messages, F U N word, and all that type of stuff. So, um, but we here, yo. We here. There's a lot of people on the beach to chill out. Uh, you know, we had to get the caipirinha. 
Dean finishes. Yo, Dean finishes. You say, you say Kool Aid? <laughs> yo, Dean literally finishes in like less than 10 minutes, yo. I'm looking, I'm counting. I'm like, yo, did this dude just finish a whole. And these are strong, yo. These are strong. And he finished it quick. So just be watching out for a person like Dean.